Hi, I'm going to explain you now vehicular cloud data collections for intelligent transportation systems. So here the main of, main aim of the object is in Internet of Things. So in wireless network, in wireless sensor networks, in ad hoc networks. So communicating between the vehicle to vehicular communications. So here so it will communicate it not only it's communicating so it will distribute the data from one vehicle to another vehicles so entire this cloud system is maintaining is a one onboard unit okay so this is the architecture of this proposed model so these are the vehicles in this wireless sensor network so vehicles can distribute the uh, some informations to the another vehicles it is the vehicular to vehicle communications so after receiving the vehicular vehicle after receiving the uh, data from vehicle so it will give the acknowledgement so this is the vehicular communications so this is the in vehicular equipments equipment means is a onboard unit and internal sensors we can able to do so after receiving the files from vehicles it will give the acknowledgement back to the vehicles so So this is the Eclipse IDE. By using this IDE only, we are going to uh, we are develop the this Windows applications. So f first, we have to run the mainframe, mainframe dot Java. See here, these are the vehicles. This is the uh, roadside uh, roadside RSU roadside unit. This is the networks. So these are the vehicles. So proof of concept these are the vehicles. So now vehicle is started. So text files I'm transferring from one vehicle to another vehicles. So first vehicle is starting. I'm starting the vehicle start. So distribute the key initializations. So here this is the HMAC initializations. You can select the files, text files, download. So this one is the car 1 status this one is the car 2 status that extra that entire data the text files is the uh, distributed uh, split into the uh, two forms so this is one vehicle 1 data so this is the vehicle 2 data S so these are the acknowledgement so car 1 request for the TE verified trust authority is verified trust authority has been verified successfully and car1 can be able to download the file and car2 request for trust authority verifications and trust authority verified successfully car2 can able to download the remaining files okay so this is the